All right then, so we've looked recently at how to install the real name fixes for Football Manager and the logos as well. But did you know there's also a real name fix and logos available for Football Manager Mobile? Well, now you do, and in today's video, we're going to look at exactly how to install them. So I found this on a website called FMM Vibe. You just come here to Downloads and where it says here, Real Name license fix we're going to go to that page now of course there's different things going on if you're an iphone user or an android user i'm on an android so i'm going to show you the android way the uh iphone instructions though i will share them on the screen even if i can't actually show you how it's done now, you do have to sign into the website to do this but that's no big problem you scroll down you see here there's different instructions for ios devices and android devices so you've got two options basically you can download it from here to your computer and then transfer it over to the necessary folder in your phone or you can download it directly onto your phone which is what i'm going to do now so uh, on the phone we just come over here to downloads real names license fix just makes a bit more sense i think to do it on the phone so we download this file changes.txt that's the one we want for some reason i've got to wait a few seconds until it downloads properly okay but if i come to my downloads file now we see there changes dot text now i just need to move this into the football manager mobile folder so i'm just going to navigate my way there so we go to internal storage si games documents that's where we need to be sports interactive and you can see i had last year's version here as well football manager 2023 mobile and then you can see it's got it selected so copy here that file is now in the game directory folder okay so now we flip the phone over because we're loading up the game which of course is only in landscape format I do think for football manager mobile they should make it so you can play it in portrait mode i think that would be that would just make for greater usability but what we need to do now is go to settings so we just tap on that and then we just tap view here at the bottom and we're going to come to user interface and then we just scroll down a little bit to reload skin you see i think there must be an option here to reskin the game but hopefully now when I just load up a game, I'm just going to load up a new game with England. I've done a test save with Orlando City that you might have seen there. So we'll just pick any old team to manage. Yeah, you can see now here the names are changed. So it's instead of Premier Division, it's Premier League instead of just FA Cup. It's the Emirates FA Cup. We've got all the sponsorship names in there as well. Okay, now just quickly back to the FMM Vibe website because there is something else we can download here. So if we go again to downloads and this time, um, now they don't have a full set of logos, but you can see here Premier League round logos. So we're going to have a look. Let's download this file as well. This is going to come as a zip file this time. Okay, so that file's downloaded. So if we come over to my downloads, we'll see it here. So we've got competitions and clubs. We're going to extract both of those. So you see here we've got round logos, Premier League, and then comps and clubs in there. So again, we're just going to copy that and we're going to navigate our way internal storage si games documents sports interactive football manager 2023 mobile now here we need a directory that says pictures logos we don't actually have one here so i'm just going to have to create it myself so we just come to create folder so we're going to call this folder pictures so we created that then if we just pop into the pictures folder there it is we're going to just add in another folder here, yeah, create folder, and we're going to call this one icons, following the instructions as per the site. And then we're going to copy our two folders into there. So again, we load up a Football Manager Mobile. And again, we go to settings, then we hit view and user interface once more. And same as last time, we just scroll down and hit reload skin so if we just load that game that we just set up with arsenal we'll confirm that there hopefully now we should see logos for our premier league teams so if i come here to england and the premier league yep you can see there we've got round logos for all of the clubs we've got a kind of round logo for the Premier League as well. So like I said, slightly different instructions if you're on an iOS Apple device. I'm putting those up on the screen now. They'll probably make more sense to you if you're an Apple user than they do to me. I've also put links down to FMM Vibe and their pages for downloading these packs if that's what you're interested in. And yeah, if you want to see more Football Manager Mobile content on the channel, let me know. 
And if you want to find out how to install logos and real name fixes and all of that stuff in the main game, check out this video here.